Today on Two Crazy Ketos, we're going to review some breakfast options. And we'll take a taste right, right after, after this. this. What's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, Two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. If you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like product reviews, we do recipe videos, we talk about various keto topics, and then once a week, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us on different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we also have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com, and that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon and that way every single time we upload a new video you'll be alerted to it yeah so when we were out at KetoCon, we got to meet the owner and founder of high key snack foods he was a super nice guy named john and we found out that he actually grew up on a coffee farm in tanzania and like how awesome would it be to grow up on a coffee farm yeah, right that'd like, be awesome coffee it would probably be my dream right but he didn't stay in um tanzania he actually moved outside of washington and took over a bed and breakfast yeah he took over a failing bed and breakfast and then they ended up like basically having their own little like garden yeah for like creating all the meals and stuff for all the gas and he realized that there was a need for you know having healthier foods and everybody doesn't have the option of growing their own food right you know all they can really do is try to make good choices based on the available products. Right. So he decided to start making like healthy snack options, which mm -hmm. is where high key foods comes in. And he actually lured us in, Rachel said he lured us in with cookies. Yeah. So this was the first product we got to try. We're going to do this in a separate video. These are like mini cookies and they were really good. You dangle cookies in front of me, you're getting my attention. You know what these reminded me of? And again, we'll do another video. They reminded me of like the little boxes of chocolate chip cookies you would get as a kid. They have that nice crunch to They're them. They're very crunchy, like Chips Ahoy crunch. But today we're talking about breakfast items. Yeah. So they sent us a couple of things for us to review. Because honestly, I thought that like instant hot cereal and like um this is a granola. granola like a lot of granolas i've kind of put this in the category of never gonna happen again right. for me because of how high in carbs that most of these are well this is a brand new product i don't even think it's available yet okay so this is a brand new product and i'm really intrigued by it so they're all breakfast items and oh by the way we're doing a giveaway. Yes. So we're going to be doing a breakfast giveaway. We're going to give away a bag of granola mm -hmm. and then the instant hot cereals. And they're going to send it directly to you. Yeah. But we'll talk about the giveaway after we try because we haven't even tried this stuff. Right. So it may taste like, I don't know, feet. I we hope don't, not. We don't want to suggest. So let's start off with the granola because the granola is a brand new product. Okay. It's mm -hmm. not even out yet. They had a bag of it when we were at KetoCon, but we didn't even get to try it. No, we were focused on cookies. Yeah. So we're looking on the back here. So there is a little bit of copy here. It says, uh, fuel the journey made with simple, clean ingredients. These are snacks that will let you fill up on a great taste without slowing you down. They give you the nourishment you need to get to your next milestone. Grab them on the go whenever you need a boost or take a bite in the right direction. And it says the high key way, they're all grain free, gluten free, made with pumpkin, sunflower, flax, and chia seeds. They're keto friendly, low net carb, no added sugars, a good source of fiber and calcium. So we'll talk about the ingredients. Yeah. Ingredients. Almonds, natural sweetener, which is erythritol, monk fruit extract, and stevia extract. Pumpkin seeds, sunflower seeds, flax seeds, hydrologized collagen, coconut oil, cinnamon, uh, chia seeds, uh, turmeric, cinnamon, vanilla extract, and sea salt. So clean ingredients. Super clean ingredients. Like you said, very simple and clean. Yep. So eight, now we've got uh, the nutrition facts. There are nine servings in this bag, and this is a pretty yeah, decent size bag. Nice size bag. So I'm looking for okay. Here, take a can Santa soda can. There, it's a pretty decent size bag. Yeah. Just to give you some perspective. Speaking of so, soda. 170 calories per serving, 14 grams of fat, eight grams of protein. You have 10 total carbohydrates in a serving, four grams of dietary fiber, four grams of erythritol. So that's two net carbs per serving. Which, I mean, if you've been missing granola, that yep. was sort of like unheard of, those yeah. carbs. I always rip it wrong. I'll just be super excited if we manage to like salvage the Ziploc resealable thing. Because usually I, I did rip it. it. I salvaged it. And lose it. Ooh. Oh. You smell? Mmm. Okay, so. Does this have like... A flavor this of granola? This looks like the most best granola, like most like a granola that I've ever seen on keto. Cinnamon almonds. So take a look at that. 
That, look at that. Oh my goodness, yes, it looks like big clusters. You wanna measure out, before we even taste it, you wanna yes. measure out what a serving is? We have our scale here. Yeah, because if I don't measure it out, this is a serving. <laughs> okay, so a serving size is a third of a cup or 35 grams. Let's switch over to grams. Oh my gracious. More. I can't believe this. Here there we go. go. 35 grams. So this is the serving size. That's kind of nice. Okay, let's do this. Pour, put out your hands and dump it right in your hands so we can see what a serving is. That is a nice serving. Not too close. Ooh. That's a serving. Nice. Now let's put it back where we're going to eat it all. Yes, we will. Okay, back in there. You ready? Mm-hmm. Smells so good. That is crunchy. Wow. Can you guys hear it crunch? Wow. Wow. That is nice. That is a good crunch all the way through. Every ingredient. Mm hmm I mean you can see every ingredient, mm -hmm. but it's got a nice sweetness to it. It's got a sweetness to it, but it's not overly sweet. It's like a sweetness on the back end. It definitely has Hold a on, the dog is here. <laughs> okay, go lay down. Okay. So yeah, it's got a nice sweetness, but only on the back end. It's got a nice cinnamon flavor, but mm -hmm. it's not like that cinnamon that's gonna burn your mouth. Right. You know, it's got a very nice kinda, I think flavor. the erythritol is offsetting it and then the sweet the cinnamon is kind of offsetting that cooling effect. Because yeah. I'm really not getting much of a cooling effect on my tongue. Yeah, no that is nice. Okay. So do we want to like put each of these two or five things, or should we just do an overall five things? Let's for the do an breakfast? overall five things because I mean, really, this is just about we're doing breakfast. Line. We're doing yeah. breakfast, right? Okay, so now we've got instant hot cereal, and they sent us two different flavors. Cocoa we'll almond. Leave this over here so we can see it. Cocoa what almonds. What flavors? That is cocoa almond, and this is strawberries, strawberries and, and cream. cream. I got to tell you, I'm really excited to try the strawberries and cream. Okay, well then we'll do that one. So it's got the same copy on the back. And then, um, okay, we'll go over to nutrition. So the ingredients on this are hemp seeds, coconut, sunflower seeds, milk protein isolate, uh, pecans, natural sweetener, which is erythritol, monk fruit, and stevia. Then we have flaxseed meals, chia seeds, dried strawberries, natural strawberry flavor, hydrologized collagen, sea salt, natural vanilla flavor, contains milk, soy, and tree nuts. Now, obviously, there's no strawberries in here. I hope not. It's a little bit different. And did you say you have pecans? Yeah. Okay, I don't have pecans in here. It's almonds. Okay. And obviously, that's going to have cocoa, I'm assuming, right? Yeah, cocoa powder. Okay. So, serving size, serving on this, there's seven and a half servings in this bag, a third of a cup Per serving, 160 calories, 12 grams of total fat, 9 grams of protein, 10 total carbohydrates, 4 grams of dietary fiber, 4 grams of erythritol. So it is 2 net carbs per serving. So this one's a little bit different. This has 10 more calories. Okay. Okay, so it's 170 calories per serving, same serving size. 13 um, grams of fat versus 8 grams of protein for this one. Total carbohydrates is 11 grams versus 10 for that one. However, there's still four dietary fiber and this time five grams of the sugar alcohol. So you're still looking at two net two carbs. Two net carbs. Okay, so there's a thing on here on how to cook in the back. You want to read that? Sure. So combine a fourth a cup of boiling water and a third a cup of keto cereal in a bowl and stir. Let it sit one to two minutes before eating. If you're going to put it into the microwave, combine one-fourth to one-third cup of water and one-third cup of keto cereal in a microwave-safe bowl, and then stir it. Microwave on high for one minute, stirring after 30 seconds, and then stir again. Let it sit one to two minutes before eating. Sounds like you're just making regular oatmeal. old like Okay, oatmeal. so which one are we trying? Definitely strawberries and cream. We're doing strawberries and cream. We will go make this, and we'll be right back. Okay, here we go. Well, that certainly looks like oatmeal. It smells delicious. But it looks like oatmeal with lots of seeds in it, yeah. which is what I would expect. <laughs> now, I will say, so I put I put everything into a ramekin, okay. and the ramekin's about half full. So that's that's going to be a serving. All right. And the longer you let this sit, the thicker you're going to get. Now, I did it one of the smaller amount of water, a quarter of a cup. Mm -hmm. You're obviously going to get more, kind of like your Ooh. oatmeal cheat that you used to do. The yes. more water you get, and then you let it sit, and you get more and more and more More and volume. More. So... Ooh, as you stir it, I smell more strawberry. Yeah, so that's because I don't like what see it's strawberry. Look like. It's focusing on my face. I see it. Ooh, it's nice and hot. Yeah, it's very hot. You ready? Yeah. 
Oh, I see some strawberries now. Wow. That's like oatmeal. Oh my goodness. And there's no oats in here. No. Okay, that's for you. You know what this reminds me of? Oh my gosh, I want to just eat this whole thing right now. This may be lunch. Remember when we used to get like that, um, like Quaker oatmeal that was in like a pouch and we used to make it for the kids? This reminds me of what I always wanted a kid. You need to eat some of this. It's good. So it reminds me of the boxes of... Yeah, the Quaker instant oatmeal where you have like the cinnamon spice and the different yeah. flavors and stuff like that. It's got that same feeling, the same taste. It's, I mean, when you talk about that, it's, it is sweet. It's not sweet. Mm. It's sweet, but not sweet. If, does that make sense? Like yeah. sweet, but not sweet. It's got a hint of sweetness, but it's not like you're eating candy where it's like, oh my gosh, I can't eat this for breakfast. It almost even has like, are you getting a little bit of a banana taste? I don't, I don't think there's any bananas in it, but there's like a... I don't know, but... That kind of... Subtle sweet. It's nice and creamy. I like the crunch. But then you got the crunch from, the, where this one's got pecans in it, right? Mm-hmm. From the nuts. Yeah. The strawberry flavor is like on point. I think it's, I honestly, I think the strawberry is subtle, but I'm not upset about well, it. Well, that's what I mean by on point. It's not like overpowering strawberry. It's no. just got that, that strawberry back note as you're eating it, where it's like you're not eating a bowl of strawberries, so you're not getting, because sometimes strawberries for me, like, kind of give me a tangle on the tongue. So it's got a strawberry flavor, but the strawberry's not overpowering everything else. It's good. It's so, really, really good. Yeah, I'm, like, super impressed. I can't believe that they achieved it without any oats. Yeah. I mean, because, yeah, it is just like oatmeal. Other than the texture of the, the, the pecans and the chia seeds, like... It really feels like it's just an oatmeal. Now, I'm going to definitely have to brush my teeth after this one because, like, they go into every spot. Like, <laughs> definitely want to brush your teeth before okay, you so go out into the world. You want to put this through five things? Yeah, five, five things. Five things. So we're going to do all of it together in five yeah. things, like breakfast in general. Okay, so if you're new to our channel, we review all products based on five things. We talk about the ingredients. Does a keto base on a nutrition label? Uh, how does it taste? How much does it cost? And finally, would we recommend it? Yep. Okay. So we're going to do it on all three since it is kind of like a breakfast combination. Yeah. And they're all very similar. I was going to say they're very similar in ingredients. Yep. I mean, I'm just thinking about this one too. How, you know, you could add some almond milk to this. So it's just going to depend. Do you want creamy or do you want crunchy? I mean, and there is a, some crunch in There's the There's a little bit of creamy, crunch in this. But I this mean, is this is super crunchy. Like super. you can take this to the movies as a snack or. It would make a nice cereal. Yeah. Or make a nice cereal out of it. Okay, so number one, the ingredients. I think the ingredients are great. I feel really There's, good. On all three of them, there is nothing in here you can't that say. you can't pronounce. The only thing, if you want to say you can't pronounce something, is they have the botanical names for monk fruit and stevia. Yeah, no, I'm not saying that. <laughs> but other than that, like, you know every ingredient. Like, you don't even have to look in a dictionary, like, what is that? I seriously cannot believe that one of these ingredients is not oats. Right. Because it's, it, it is I amazing. am telling you, it really reminds you of that. Yep. So, uh, ingredients are good. Yeah. So, number two, does it keto based on the nutrition label? I think absolutely. I mean, certainly if you are a total carb person, you're going to have to, like, use this in moderation because mm -hmm. it's going to take out a half or a third, depending on how many total carbs you allow for yourself. Right. Um, it's going to impact your day. But but I think you wouldn't be sad about it's it. It's no different than, like, even any of the bars or anything like that. I mean, all of my bars are, like, 12 yeah. to 14 total carbs. Because you're getting a good-sized serving. Yep. And it's all yummy. Yeah, but, I mean, overall, 160 calories, 12 grams of total fat. Nine grams of protein, so there's more fat than protein. Yeah. You have 10 total carbohydrates. You have two net carbs. I mean, and the bottom line is most people do new net carbs. And these are good ingredients. Like, there's right. no, like, is there fiber I should be, uh, that, like, you really can't take out? So, like, this is even an, a, an, a product where I would be like, hemp, you know, I don't have a problem with doing net carbs on this. Because yeah. every one of these are decent things. Like, hemp seeds, you take that kind of stuff out. Like, sunflower seeds, you can absolutely take that fiber out, you know? Yeah, it isn't a bunch, it is not a bag of chemicals that are being put together to get you to two net carbs. Yeah, absolutely. So, number three, how does it taste? It tastes so good. I think that kids would really love this. Yeah. I mean, it's delicious. And also, it, I mean, it feels good when you're eating it. It tastes good. If you like the soft, it's got a nice mouthfeel for the soft stuff, the, the hot cereal. And if you like crunchy, you're going to love that. Yep. 
So I think, yeah, I think the taste is incredible. I'm like shocked by this. I'm really shocked. I by and this. I re-looked over like there's some sugar in this because it's got that like nice, especially the the cere- the instant cereal um, or the hot cereal. It's more of that. It it really tastes like there's got to be some sugar in there because it's that good. But it's now not. you can see. Because it's sitting, it's getting like thicker and thicker. So you like can oatmeal. definitely add more water to this because the chia seeds are just going to puff up and puff up and puff up. Yeah, if you'd like some a more, lot more volume. volume. Yeah. That is just really good. They just have the perfect blend of the erythritol, the stevia, and the monk fruit. It's just the perfect blend. When there's no cooling, there's no funny taste. It's like sugar. It yeah, really it is It really like is like sugar. sugar. I do believe that they actually even sell on their website their blend of monk fruit, stevia, and erythritol. Oh my God, so you could use it in baking. Yeah, you can use it in baking or whatever. I mean, it's just the perfect blend. Like, I'm shocked. Yeah, I'm really okay. shocked. So number four, how much does it cost? Okay. Okay. Break it to me. Here's the thing. I have no price on this because oh. it's not out yet. This okay. is now they sent it to us ahead of time, asked us to try it, see what we think, and we're going to do a giveaway to kind of help launch the product. All right. Uh, but I do not know how much this one is. If by the time I'm done editing this video, she lets me know, I will put it here along the bottom of the screen. If there's nothing there, it's because I don't know yet. Or Sorry. They, they haven't told us. Okay. Yeah. So as for the instant hot cereals, um, you can get it on Amazon. Okay. Uh, you can get it on their website, but you're better off just going right to Amazon. I will leave a link down below. It's thirteen dollars and forty seven cents a package. Okay. So that works out to be what about a dollar eighty a serving. All right, that's which not, is not bad. That's not I don't terrible. think it's bad. No, especially when you compare it to like the 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 newer like keto cereals that are coming out. Right. Yeah, they're not. Those cheap. things are like ten eleven dollars a box <laughs> right. as well. Um, and calorie for calorie, I think it's a good thing. Mm-hmm. But here's the cool part is they always have coupons on Amazon. So right now, if you go on to Amazon and you can buy it, there's a $2 off coupon. So oh, nice. now instead of thirteen forty seven, you pay eleven forty seven. Well, I like coupons. Yeah. So, the, and that's where they do a lot of their coupons is just right on their website, right on Amazon. There's a little thing, you know, click here for the coupon or whatever. Mm-hmm. There's also a third flavor, by the way, that she didn't send me. There's what a cinnamon it? flavor. Nice. Yeah. But I don't know. It's going to be hard to beat that strawberry one. I know. This one is good. We'll have to try this one another day. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. I think overall price kind of falls right in line with yeah. all of your keto products. You're paying a higher price than like Quaker Instant Oatmeal, well, but you're getting a different product you're than getting Quaker a different product. Instant I mean, Oatmeal. None of these ingredients in here are cheap. Hemp seeds aren't cheap. You know, sunflower seeds, you know, you're... Getting all almonds, your different sweeteners, pecans. almonds, flaxseed meal. Like, to go and try to combine all of these, it's going to cost you a fortune to begin yeah, with. it would. Okay, so number five, right? Would we recommend it? Definitely. Yep. And I wasn't sure, you know, until we tasted it, and I thought either it's going to be too clunky and not taste good, or um, it's going to have some hidden ingredients that we just didn't see when we're, you know, when they're putting out the tray to sample things. Right. You know, you're like, this is too good to be true. Give me the bag. Well, it's funny because when uh, Heike contacted us, you know, like, because we talked to them there and then they contact us via email and we were talking and they're like, hey, we're going to send it to you. And we, you can do a giveaway if you like it, but like, I don't know if you're going to like it. And then like, as soon as Rachel and I even saw the ingredients, we're like, what's not to like? Yeah. I mean, before we even tasted, this is the first time we're tasting it. Right. right? Well, I thought when I saw these ingredients, I'm like, is this going to taste as good as it sounds, sounds in the ingredients? So I'm pleasantly surprised yep. that it does. It's, it's really good. Yeah. So I would recommend it based on everything. I mean, it tastes good. You know, it is a little bit on the higher end of price, but so is every other like good keto healthy option, just like yeah. any other good health food. Uh, there are coupons available. I love the fact you can get it on Amazon so you get free shipping. Yeah. Right? And uh, nutrition's good. Everything about it is good. Feel good about this. So giveaway. Okay, we're going to run this giveaway a little bit longer than we normally do. Usually we go one week. Mm-hmm. Uh, we're going to run this giveaway through the 24th of July. All right. So you have, I don't know, from when we release this video, probably about 12 or 13 days. Okay. So that's pretty good. We'll do it the same way we always do it. Leave a comment down below. Leave. Any comment will do. Well, you got to be subscribed to the channel. Right. And you do have to... What? Hit the like button. Yeah. You have to hit the like button. Mm-hmm. And then leave any comment down below. Oh, and you have to live in the continental United States. Yes. Okay. And then at the very bottom of the description of this video are all the rest of the legal rules of the giveaway. Okay? We <laughs> are not... state that. We are not growing these hemp seeds. So, right. like, I can't confirm that they were college-educated hemp seeds. Like, yeah. I don't know. So, yeah, so the giveaway is being provided completely by Heike. We didn't buy it. Um, and what we're going to do is we will do a drawing on the 24th in its own video. Mm-hmm. 
and then uh, you get a hold of us, and we will c- contact Heike, and Heike will mail it directly to you. Nice. And I'm sure it's going to be the same way with us. This came to us through Amazon. I didn't even know I was getting an Amazon pro- uh, package, and all of a sudden it showed up on my door. You're always happy when the doorbell rings and it's Amazon. Absolutely. So is that good? So we're yeah. going to run through the 24th. Be subscribed to the channel. Hit the like button. Comment down below. Awesome. I can't wait to give away Let us some- know down in the comment section, maybe when you comment, which one are you more anxious yeah. to try? Oh, by the way, so the giveaway is a breakfast bundle. We're doing a bag of the granola and then the hot cereal. Oh, nice. So it's you're getting a breakfast bundle. I is like the that. Giveaway. That's so. good. Well, if you guys like what you saw today, do us a favor. Hit that like button down below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell icon. And that way, every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time. Bye. Bye.